Hey guys, welcome to the video. Today in this video, what I wanted to do was get the hardest achievement in 1.17 Minecraft. Because if you don't know what it is, it's to wax every single type of copper block in the game. And only 0.1% of players have done this. So yes, if it's not the hardest, it's, probably, it's not hard. But it's definitely not one of the easiest challenges to get done. So in this video, what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be trying to build a super small tavern because I've got all the copper here as you can see I'm not running out of copper anytime soon so what I need to do is I need to get all the copper blocks I need to make all the copper blocks and then I need to go to my bee farm and get all of the wax because I don't think wax is a problem so what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna <coughs> get these set up I only made seven out of two stacks Okay, so apparently you need to separate them five blocks apart. You need to separate the blocks, the couple blocks, five blocks from each other to get the best results, as in like seven blocks a day. Hold on, let me just look back just to keep. Five apart, it takes eight days for 64 blocks to get oxidized fully, and you get seven a day. So, what I need to do. Is I need to find a large area or get a large area. This area over here probably will work. Let's get to flattening out this small area. Okay, so instead of flattening out the whole area, I've got most of it flat. This this will be enough. I think this will be enough. <coughs> so I'm gonna start setting out. I'm gonna start smelting actually the copper. Now that everything's put away, I need to get rid of some stuff because I'm running out of chest space. I have a whole room. I'm gonna show you. Because as you can see, they're all asleep now. This is my This is my village of trading. Um Paul. These are gonna be crafting areas. Crafting areas already set up here, here, and two here with iron in them. But this is my bulk storage area and I haven't gotten to gotten around to like using it I also was gonna put a super smelter on this side <laughs> one with different stuff or one some with different stuff but I'm just planning on making that whole just all metal or all, all crafting what I'm planning on making that all just ores there you go all just ores I'm gonna make that all for ores so that when I eventually do need to smelt stuff in bulk I can just do it there and I forgot why but this stuff goes in this chest how much rails would this get me? 48 that's decent I don't mind that I'll use those I think this is way more than enough as well and hoppers as you know take iron and every time I run out of iron it's because I make hoppers and I really hate hoppers. It's probably my least favorite weapon game now, just because of this. Oh god, I had a lot of blast furnace and I don't know where they're gone. I have more normal furnaces. I'm just gonna make more. I'm that that's good. That's annoyed me, Loki. I'm gonna go make some more smooth stone as well, because you know. I need that. I want it to be in there, in this area. <coughs> so I'm gonna, I'm gonna hollow out the area behind probably, and then get to work it. Why are you lenses here? Yeah, this will be enough. Okay. Catch on. Mr. Cat, by the way, go subscribe to Mr. Cat. Misty Cat? Mr. Cat. Yeah, I'll put a card. These, however, I'm gonna need more for furnaces. I need to go, I need a silk touch. Is my silk touch mm, pickaxe still diamond? Here it is. Frostmoker? No mending, okay. 
mending and thorns for one emerald. Okay, mending. Thank you. Goodbye. So you so touch mending. Take that. So touch mending on breaking and twelve. I need to go to my Enderman farm, which is not close, and I still need to finish the tunnel. So we're gonna make a trip to my Enderman farm. Um, God, I need in my inventory. I need this, this. This, this, and this. That noise was snow falling off my roof. That was that scared the life out of me. Chest, hopper, furnace, hopper, furnace, hopper, chest. And do this. That goes into the furnace. Correct. Split this. That smelts it. It should go down into this. That should smelt it to smooth stone and then put it in there. Now, if I am correct. Yes. And it smelts it to smooth stone. And then when I get back, I should have two stacks of smooth stone. I am like the biggest brain human. I'm not. But yeah, that's. And it smelts it to smooth. That, oh, I was just so good at Minecraft. Okay, so we're in the nether. Oh, no. No. Because that platform that I'm st I was standing on was literally one block thick. And if they blow that up, it's... No. Also, this. Punching it made it lag. But yeah, this is... This is ten times faster than walking, obviously. But before I used to walk this whole distance. I need to fly to... The first number needs to be 15,000, so we're still a thousand blocks away. From 900 to 1,500, walking them 600 blocks took two minutes. I have to walk 1,500 blocks. Imagine how walking 600 blocks took two minutes. Double that, four minutes, and then half that. Quarter it? I don't know. And we are here. So you walk across, or you can fly across this area i made sure to build it when the chunks load in so that i don't die you know i made sure to build it somewhere where you cannot see as soon as you walk in for one reason of last time i built one of these you walk you got into the end like where you spawned the platform and you look left and it was literally like a diagonal right there and it was so jarring for me so now when you come into the end just in case i build something in the end <clears throat> when you come to the end, it's just, it's just the end. I'm not hitting you guys. I'm gonna fly straight back into the nebula, like so. Boom. Oh hey, this is smelting like really. How much is left? Oh, this is the last stack. Oh no, it's not. There's a whole stack in there. This means it's got like 12. We've got seven. I'm really confused on whether how 20 plus blast furnaces have disappeared to. 20 plus. Just randomly disappear. I doubt it's where I'm about to go. I doubt it's in the lab. If it's in the lab, I'm going to cry. It's not in the lab chest, and there's no other place it can be in the lab. Oh, there's a chest that it leads to. It ciphers to a chest. I'm gonna have the chest be visible here. I should probably hurry up and put that chest. Because your villagers are nosy. Yeah, I did it. This and then I'm gonna have over here one, two. I do one, two, and then that one is the chest, so it's here. It's where the chest will be laid. It's like this on the other side. No, it's not. It's half of the chest showing on the other side, so it's like this. Yes. 
we're going to test that theory in a second we're going to extend the roof out by one we're going to go up up to this part and outage we built we're building the top part of the super smarter where the coal is going to go to but i obviously want a vantage point so i can actually see what i'm doing and don't mess up so boom 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 excuse me if i'm not mistaken this is the layout the the final layout this not so far off because then i'm gonna run out of rails instead of that i'm just gonna that boom 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 and then railways am i wait a minute am i stupid So, after many problems, I finally figured out why it wasn't working. I was using the wrong rail the whole time. So now, it works. I won't say perfectly, because I haven't done the coal side. However, this part works now. This works. I'm going to put that there so it looks symmetrical. I'm going to make it complicated. Lap it. Why is that lapis? Put a block there. Move! So now when I... Let's torch. Because I don't trust it. So now when I do... Where's the second? Get the lever. And do this. The second one should go off. To make sure it does work, I'm gonna do this. Okay, it, it works. I just realized I'm an idiot. I was gonna make them separate. So, this one, after that one, it should be a block of this. Same with here. Should be a block. this it's gonna connect yep when these are finished I don't have enough hoppers <sighs> I am oh how, how am I so low I'm still baffled on how I'm <sighs> the elytra is the worst thing in the game Hate the elytra. I've had to do this before. Open. I need ten iron. Make two minecarts. Put them in the furnace thing, and then I'm finished. Finally, finished making a smart that I've been recording for two hours. Five, enough. Two minecarts. Two minecart hoppers. And if I power it, yes, the minecart moves. Okay. So that's one, and. That's one. Is that one? No. That's one. When this one's on, it goes like that. Yes. It's finished.
please give them to me and they'll go into the deactivated. Okay, so if I do this, this, yes, it is working. It is working. And then this, I have to put this in manually, sadly. Stack and a half in both. This should be filtering outwards. We're taking out to this. But now, if I am correct, which I am, <laughs> yeah, yeah, go down. Turn this on and this on. This has something in it. This doesn't have coal in it for some reason. Because the hop out of is probably. F I'm gonna break something. Ah. Uh, this hopper? This doesn't have a hopper, dumbass. No, I broke it. Oh no. My machine is broken. I Move back. Place that. It should work now. It was like this. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you like subscribe and subscribe. Stay happy. This was a very long episode. The main, main damn the main thing of this episode was to get the hardest achievement in the game and it took me an hour to make the super smelter Watch, I need to make a couple blocks and then set them out in a 5x5 five five area in this area and then within a couple of days we should a couple of minecraft days we should have enough copper to get the achievement and we'll be one of the only players 0.1% one one of players in minecraft bedrock that have this achievement 